So the withdrawal from our, uh, Iraq in 2011 uh, was a really bad decision. You know, the Biden, uh, uh, well, the Obama-Biden administration, this was back when Vice President Biden was, uh, was in charge then, made a horrific decision to withdraw in 2011 and abandon our allies and it resulted in the emergence and expansion and growth of ISIS and uh, was a horrific thing to do. And what they did then is exactly what they're doing in Afghanistan today and that is withdrawing not based on the conditions on the ground but withdrawing based on a timeline, a political timeline and what's happened we're seeing it unfold daily with provisional capital after provisional capital falling to the uh, Taliban and this is uh, I pray to God that what happened to the Kurdish people and the Iraqi people, uh, the Syrian people, does not happen in Afghanistan. But I fear it will, because the same person is in charge, and the same decisions are being made, and they're the wrong decisions. So um, I think it's a tragedy. I think that's a good question for President Biden. You know, we will have forces in Kuwait, and we will have the ability to do what's called over the horizon missions but um, you know I think it's a bad idea for us to uh, withdraw the way we're draw withdrawing it's just it shouldn't be done this way uh, Saddam Hussein you know it was uh, it was a surreal moment you know going into the cell with Saddam Hussein and and being a part of the mission that captured him um, it was pretty amazing so uh, well, we are with you. We're, you know, there are those of us here in America who are with you. We won't abandon you. We uh, are doing everything we can to, to block what the Biden administration is trying to do. Uh, we will fight and be a loud voice and we'll also listen. So just know that. And uh, thank, you for, thank you to the Kurdish people, for especially the Peshmerga who fought alongside Americans to uh, you know, get rid of ISIS. Um, as I said earlier, the blood of Americans, my friends that are fellow military guys, um, you know, is in the soil with the blood of the Peshmerga. So, thank you.